All right, Shalom. All right, first and foremost, I'd like to get all praise and glory and honor to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Wakakodash. I'd like to say double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone that rule well. I'd like to say peace and salutation to the elect that's pushing his word in truth, sincerity, and charity. All right. Uh, I'm doing my video response to this um to um to this brother, um, GMS Awakening 144. All right, I'm Juan Kabar. Um, yeah. Uh, this is my response to this video, and this is this is wicked as hell, man. And the Lord is not fucking playing, man. Okay, He is not playing with you, with you, with you, Jakes out here, man. The Lord will actually make you look like a fool. When you lead this truth, man. All right. A goddamn fool, man. Excuse my language, but it's vexing. It's very, very vexing, man. And basically, you see two men together. Basically, you see two men together. Okay. So, the Lord will give you up. He will give you up. He will give you over to the world, man. He will give you over to the, to these wolves, man. Okay. This 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 ain't no joke. This, this, this You know what? And this is the prime example that... The Lord would do this shit to you, man. He would do this to you, man. All right. So we gotta, we gotta, we gotta be, man, mindful, man. Very mindful, man. And 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 tell the Lord don't spew spew um you out of His mouth and take your Holy Spirit away from you, man. This this ain't no joke. The Lord would fuck you up like this, man. And I pray, and I pray, I I, I don't want to be one. I don't want to be not name one of these one of these motherfuckers. Excuse my language, so lock you for that, but hey man, it is what it is, okay? But um I'm gonna go to the scriptures real quick. And um I'm gonna close out. But yeah, man, this is my response to the brother's video, man. This this is some wicked shit. Let's say this this dude on the left right here. He was in a uh DC camp and they say he won he wasn't really, you know, part of a camp or something like that. But he said he was part of a DC camp, and he also he he left he left um he left Great Millstone, he left the truth. And this will happen when you leave the truth, man. I really don't know I don't really don't know the guy like that. I never I think I'd seen him once before, like you know on a video or something like that. But then really, you know, what I'm saying I really don't remember his face. But but yeah, man, yeah yeah, you can't can't leave this uh this faith, man. This 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 knowledge, man. This is the, this is the worst time to lead this knowledge, man. And Lord, fuck, Lord will give you over to this shit, man. But no further ado, I'm gonna go to um and 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 this 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 guy on the right, you know what I'm saying? Trans, he's with a transgender man. Okay, you you, you become a trans transgender, they are gonna have to um, you know, cut off your cut off your penis and shit, man, to turn into a vagina. Okay, that's 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 wicked, man. <laughs> But I'm gonna go to the scriptures, man. The Lord, man, the Lord is not fucking playing, man. And He's showing us his prime example of what He can do to you, man. This is Deuteronomy twenty-three and one. It say, "He that is wounded in the stones, or have his private members cut off, shall not enter into the congregation of the Most High." Okay. The reason why I put the scripture out because it's against the holy commandments, man. Not the, not the, um, you know, what I'm saying, cut off your, cut off your rod, man. Okay. Let's go to uh let's let's look it up. Privy uh members goes back to the Hebrew word uh shaf shafkal means penis, okay, male organ. All right, I'm gonna scroll down, look a pipe, okay. <laughs> Jake like to say pipe, you know what I'm saying? But uh for example, wine uh no Salakia. For example, it says uh this is the penis. Privy member, privy member, okay. So that's against the Lord, man. To cut off your private member, man. Okay, to turn into a damn trans transgender, man. Okay, it say he that is wounded in the stones or have his private member cut off shall not enter to the congregation of the Lord. All right, you is not going to enter the congregation of the Lord, man. And you damn sure ain't going to enter the uh, kingdom of heaven. You don't get destroyed on this side, man. Okay, but yeah, man, this this is wicked as hell, man. Wicked. All right, let's go to uh. Let's go to Psalms real quick. Psalms 51. And this is one of the important scriptures. 
this is the most important scriptures, man. 51 and uh, 11. It says, cast me not away from thy presence and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. And this, this is scripture you got to quote in your head, man, all the time, you know. And, and, and the Spirit, the Holy Spirit was took it from this guy, man. Because if the Lord cast your ass out of his sight, this is how you're going to be looking, man. This is how you're going to turn up the beat, okay? Because you, you can't, you don't fear the, you don't fear the Lord, man. The Lord turned you to a reprobate, okay? Real quick. It says, cast me not away from thy presence and take not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore unto me the joy of thy salvation and uphold me with thy free spirit. <laughs> okay? So that's the most important thing, man. You got to ask the Lord to restore your salvation and uphold you with thy with your, with the free spirit, man. So that's a, that's a, that's a beautiful scripture to say, man. Cast me not away, cast me not away from thy presence, man. Cuz he got cast away from from the Lord's presence, man. This is this is how you end up. Okay? It says and take not thy holy spirit from me. All right? So we in these last evil wicked times, man, not to be falling out this uh faith, falling out this um knowledge and truth, man. Okay. The, the, the we 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 coming in, we coming in, we coming in a lot, we coming into a, a a bad bad times, man. We coming in evil days. We're in the evil days now, man. Okay. And the Most High is gonna destroy this destroy this cat, man. He gonna destroy these two, man. They missile food, man. All right. Um, and then when you, when you, when you leave this truth, the Lord cast your ass out of sight. You know what I'm saying? You gonna, you gonna have demons plaguing your mind, man. And, and the, and, and the demons all in his mind, man. It's plaguing the hell out of him, man. Matthew 12 and 43. It says, when the unclean spirit is going out of a man. This when you first get in the truth. This when you first leave the world, man. Okay. He walketh through the dry place seeking to seek and rest to find of none. Okay, because when that evil spirit leave your leave your body, man, is it, it, it goes around seeking. You know what I'm saying? Who the devour, man? Okay. That's when you get into the knowledge, okay? He say, then he said, I will return into my house from whence I came out. So you, <laughs> so when you lead the truth, okay, you know, he's going to return. That same spirit is going to return back to you, okay? It says, and when he is come, he findeth it empty, swept, and garnished, okay? So when you, when you, when you go back to the world, that, that same spirit is going to return back to that same house, which is your which is your spirit go back in your mind when you first left when you first left the world okay it says then go of he and take up with himself seven other spirits more wicked than himself so man it's gonna be eight spirits plaguing your mind man he gonna take <laughs> seven more spirits okay seven more spirits seven more demons okay more wicked than himself. So the wickedness that you did in the world, okay, it's going to be 10 times worse when you leave the truth, man. Okay? And that's the scariest shit. Okay? Most wicked than himself. And they enter it and dwell there. And the last state of that man is worse than the first. Last state of that man is worse than the first, man. All right? And that's why he's having sex with a transgender, which that's a man itself, man. But that motherfucker cut off his private parts and turned into a vagina. All right. It says, and dwell there in the last state of that man worse, worse than the first. Even so shall it be also unto his wicked generation, this wicked gener generation, man. All right. And this is a wicked, Jake wicked as fuck, man. Jake is a wicked generation, man. Okay? Two-thirds of our people wicked, man. You know what I'm saying? The Lord, the Lord is going to definitely cut off two-thirds, man. 
two parts of our nation, man. Okay. Let's go to uh Yeah, because the Lord is not playing, man. He will send them see them seven evil spirits back on you, and you're gonna be the worst than before. He'll turn you to a transsexual. He'll turn you to a transgender. You know what I'm saying? You end up messing with a man. You know what I'm saying? You end up being on drugs. You end up, you know what I'm saying, just doing just doing stuff, man. Like, and then you scoffing against the uh the uh the men of the Lord, and you scoffing against the apostles, man. You know? You you saying the apostles um um breakdowns is wrong and all this here, man. The, the Lord, the Lord is not playing, man. He will cast you out of his mouth, man. He will take that spirit from you, man. You're gonna be left out here. You know what I'm saying? Without a uh, without a halo, man. All right? Angels is not going to protect you in that day. Okay? When that time comes. Okay? You're just going to be out there. This is uh, 1 Corinthians 6 and 9. It says, Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of the Most High. Be not deceived. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusive of themselves with mankind. What that mean? Goes back to the Greek word arseocortes. Ones who lies with a male as a female. Sodomite, homosexual. So basically, you know, this, this guy on the right is a homosexual. He a homosexual. So you is not going to enter the uh, kingdom of heaven, man. Okay? You is not going to enter to the Lord's rest, man. Your ass gonna get destroyed on this side. You know what I'm saying? And then you're gonna become as a newborn. You know what I'm saying? That that's for that's for leaving the faith, leaving the truth, man. Okay. The Lord turned that man into a reprobate. All right. It says, Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of the most high. Be not deceived, right? Be not deceived. Be not be not led astray. Okay. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Be not led astray, man. That's the that's the that's the best that's the best way to go in this world, man. Be not led astray, man. Okay. Um it says, be not deceived, neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate, nor abusers of themselves with mankind. Okay. So yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, because you no know, that's this basically is part of the effeminate. This is a feminine type shit, man. You know, he he with a transgender man. The Lord could turn your man. Lord is not Lord is no joke, man. He'll turn your ass into a faggot, man. All right, he'll turn you to a crackhead. He'll turn you to a um uh, man. It, it's all many ways the Lord can do to you, man. And that's why you gotta fear him, man. All right, the Lord is very terrible, man. Let's go to Hebrews. Hebrews 10 and 31. It says, it is a fearful thing to fall in the hands of the living power, man. Okay? So you got to fear the Lord, man. You got to fear the Lord, man. You got to fear the Lord in your day-to-day -day life, man. It says, it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power, man. And he fell into the he fell in the hands of the living power. And he ain't fear the Lord. Basically, he said, he said, F the Lord, man. F the apostles, F the men of the Lord, man. He basically said, F all us, man. And this will, this, and this will, uh, this will he end up with a transgender. Okay. The one that cut off his private parts, man. All right. So, man, this is the worst state to be in, man, in these last days, man. Out of this truth. Okay. You can't, you gotta, man, look. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta uh, work out your own salvation, man. Fear and trembling, fear and trembling, man. Okay. Read this again, Hebrews ten thirty one. It is a fearful thing to fall in the hands of the living power, and that's one of the beautiful scripture, man. You gotta think upon, of, think upon of, man. All right. And Psalms fifty one. All right. Cast you not away from him, man. Cast your spirit away from you, man. Okay. A fearful thing. All right. Goes back to the Greek word for for barrels means inspiring, fear, terrible, formidable, affected with fear, timid, 
Okay. You got to have inspiring fear, man. Aspiring fear of the Lord, man. Lord can do. Lord can fuck you up at any time, man. All right. That goes for me. Goes for anybody that lead this truth, man. Lord can, Lord can, Lord can jack you the hell up, man. Okay. This this is wicked. This is a wicked. This is this is this is the most wickedest thing ever, man. And this and like I said before, the Lord is basically making a prime example out of this out of this out of this character, man. Not the he's showing his power, basically, man. The Lord is showing his power. He's showing you what he can do. He's showing you what he can do to your ass, man. Okay? You don't want to you don't want to lead the truth and all of a sudden we in the last days and how shy on his way back. You don't want to lead the truth. And you turn into a motherfucking homosexual, okay? You mess with trans transgenders and shit, man. Trainees, man. All right? It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power, man. Let's go to Jeremiah 6 and 30. So, lucky, I got a um, little sinuses real quick. I'm going to close out after this um, video. This is Jeremiah 6 and 30. It said, reprobate silver shall men call them. And this guy is a reprobate silver, man. Reprobate silver, man. Shall men call them? And who the men? The men of the Lord. Okay? We calling this man as a reprobate silver because the Lord have rejected him. Rejected them. Okay? We, the Lord rejected this guy, man. Whoever fall out this truth, the Lord gonna reject you, man. Okay? You 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 turn you turn away from the most high, he's gonna reject you, you're gonna go back to the world, and Lord gonna destroy your ass. Period. Okay. So that was my response, man. You know, to the uh, GMS Awakening 144. And I hope you brothers was edified, man. You know, I tried my best through the spirit. But um I'd like to say call her law, you how about shim how shy about shim kakudash. Barack a thumb to you, Aki man. Keep pushing, man, keep fighting, man. We're almost out of here. Shalom.